Surgical resection of the breast primary in patients with stage 4 disease I think is probably one of the other really big questions that as a surgeon we need to be addressing and over the last three to five years we've seen presentations that tell us that surgical resection of the breast primary is advantageous and improves survival and then we've seen another smattering of presentations that tell us the exact opposite. Um, in my clinical practice I think the critical thing is to evaluate the patient uh, the patient's tumor factors, and probably the most important thing is their response to the systemic therapy. Um, so I like to meet these patients up front if I can. I usually tell them that there's no really strong or good data which way is the best way to treat them in terms of surgical resection. Um, let them undergo their systemic therapy, and then based on their response, um, decide whether to consider surgical resection. I think, you know, a young lady who has a single side of disease, be it in the liver or the bone, and who has a complete response to her chemotherapy, it's probably a very good candidate to consider uh, performing surgical resection. Do we have great data? No. Um, I think it's critically important that we try to ensure that our surgery is done with minimal morbidity, and most breast surgery is done with very low mortality, um, and that we have a frank discussion with our patients that we don't know the, any survival benefit clearly demonstrated related to surgical resection of the breast primary or not.